Hostra and Old Dominion for a spot in the finals. Hassell finding the open man. It's Finney. You know, I say there's good news and bad news when you play Old Dominion. Bad news here is that you got to face Charles Jenkins. James finding the trailer. Hassell dropped the shoulder. Hofstra bench wanted a call that wasn't coming. Correction, that last foul call was on Jules on the hand, not on Wilconi on the body. Long range and an electric player. Keep an eye on McClendon. He is going to be something. They all collapsed around his cell, and James came wide open for the three. That's his cell. Nice touch for the big man. I need all of them in order to beat this Old Dominion team. From the corner, Kelleher. And that's exactly what he just did. And the tipped rebound. Here comes Ostra with numbers. Oh, my, look at Bazemore. He did it again. Eliadis fading away, got it! Right before the halftime buzzer. Big shot by Eliadis, big shot. Went right into Jenkins. Baysmore, great pass. Amazingly, Jenkins didn't see him. And now Finney taking it away and paying it off at the other end. James, that'll work. James is trying to recognize it so he knows what to do, and whoa, they have. Doesn't matter. May not have been as emphatic with the same result. And Jenkins taking a step back out. It's hard to take them out of their game. That's a great point. Jenkins, got it. There goes Jenkins, blocked away. Key in the break, and Bazemore finishes it with the right hand. Trying to make the right defensive play. Unfortunately, there's no defending that. Absolutely. As long as they're going to leave somebody out on an island to guard him. To slow this thing down and run some clock as well as execute the offense. Or, or let Bazemore do it. <laughs> <laughs> and Old Dominion will dribble the clock away. Your final will be 77 to 69. Old Dominion will meet VCU tomorrow night for the CAA championship.